Kerncast 23 with Colin Jackson. Well, what are we saying? All things considered, not too bad out there these days. We're just laughing at the fact Colin says it's only 90 degrees out there. Woohoo! Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Great night. 90. Yes, for friends <laughs> out of town visiting, they think we're crazy, but we are enjoying highs in the low 90s because it could be much worse. Take a look, please, at what's going on on the water vapor loop. This is an important one because it shows the future. The immediate future is that low hanging off the coast. And what that's going to do is just keep the temperatures at bay. This allows the ocean air to move on in, not the ocean itself, thank goodness, but just the air. And uh, we will be the beneficiary of that for two more days, and then things will start to heat up. This low parked out here, look at all this moisture, that green just exploding. That is a thunderstorm complex that's going to move closer and closer to California by the time we get to all we think Sunday night. Here's the future. Future radar from 6 p.m. forward. Ignore Saturday. Nothing's going on. But look what happens on Sunday here. By 6 p.m. to midnight, the activity increases near places like Blythe, Barstow, perhaps. And uh, that will move even closer, creep closer to our area. Tuesday, especially Wednesday and Thursday, not so much for Bakersfield, but from this point eastward, thunderstorms are looking fairly likely on Wednesday for sure. The marine layer, that's the gray pattern that moves offshore. Get ready for a great weekend at the beaches. Oh, it's going to be great. 94 was the high today. 98 is the average. Oh, hot, hot weather. Uh, 66 was the low this morning. And we'll have lows like that again coming up. I think you'll really, really like it. 66 was the low, propelled us to 93 now. Winds are northwest at 13. Winds continue to blow from the northwest. Great breezes here, 15 to 20 miles per hour. 109 in Palm Springs. 88 again in the capital for Sacramento, and San Francisco only got to 72. 82 at Fraser Park, not bad at all. 82 at Tehachapi. 94 at the lake, it was 93 for you guys in Mojave. Current temperatures in the 70s now from Lebec to Tehachapi. So get ready for a great, great Friday night. It's here, the weekend. 89 for Yosemite. 67 in San Francisco. Same thing for Pismo. 72 for Santa Barbara. And temperatures in the Southland look nice too. Los Angeles, 80. So that's about 72 at the beach. And 84 for Disneyland. 90s tomorrow again. No 100s yet. Will they ever return? Never. Never. <laughs> Just you wait. 83 for Tehachapi. Southwest winds at 10 to 15 miles per hour. The desert regions look awfully nice too. 101 for California City. 102 Ridgecrest. And a 95 for Mojave. So overnight tonight we'll drop to 65. That's at 7 a.m. And by 4 o'clock we'll be at 95. It'll be the weekend. You won't care because you're going to be in your pool or a friend's pool. 106. Unhealthy for sensitive group air quality. Yes, the hundreds are coming back, and so is the humidity, but not until Tuesday of next week. So enjoy it while you can. Kern River Valley rainfall chances go 20, 40, 20 next week. And the same thing for the mountains. Rainfall chances looking good on Wednesday. Already August next week. I know. That's crazy. Mm. Wow. Thanks, Colin. Thanks, Colin. Well.